Hi everybody, welcome to I Can Has Draw. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to draw a Halloween spider in web. First, begin by drawing an oval shape kind of to the upper left of your paper, and then you're going to draw a smaller oval shape. Um, the little one's going to be the spider, and the large one up to the left is the web. And I'm going to draw the head as well for the spider. Next, I'm going to go ahead and draw the legs. I'm just doing really simple curved lines. Uh, attaching to the the body of the spider there and uh, for the inner legs I'm not even going to attach them to the body I'm gonna leave a little space there because when I come back with a sharpie marker it's just gonna look a lot better it won't look as um, crowded next I'm gonna draw the spider web coming from the spider going straight up um, I'm doing this freehand but if you feel more comfortable using a straight edge ruler go for it and now I'm going to start building the spider's web. And um, I'm doing this as an oval shape instead of a perfect circle because I found it to be much more interesting that way. Uh, too much symmetry can be kind of boring. So this is an asymmetrical drawing. And this line here that you see me drawing points right back to the spider which uh, gives a nice composition to the whole whole piece. So now is the fun part of just doing the uh, the web, you know, going around. And initially when I was uh, drawing this, I tried to draw from the middle and work outward, and I found that didn't quite work. Um, just for the composition, it, it wouldn't go the way I wanted it, and I realized, ah, I need to start with the spider first, which makes sense since you need a spider in real life before you can have a web ha 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 but this way um, it's a lot easier to um, you know space out the web like so um, I wouldn't do any more than three or four go arounds here because more than that would look kinda complicated too busy keep it simple there we go. So that's it for drawing. Now all I gotta do is um, go back over it with a sharpie marker. This might be a little bit tricky because this does require going straight. So again, if you want to use a straight edge, um, by all means do so. I'm feeling, you know, daring and bold, so I prefer the straight hand route. Plus, you can, you know, see the rest of the drawing easier for reference. But if you do want to do freehand like me, just um, relax a bit and have a nice steady grip on your sharpie marker. And the same goes for this bit of spider web too that attaches to the spider. And I'll go ahead and outline this little arachnid. And uh, this is a really good drawing for beginners. Um, however, this one does require some discipline. So if you don't get it right the first time, please don't don't beat yourself up on it or be like, oh, this is a terrible, you know, drawing. Um, you know, a lot of this has to do with um, control of the wrist and eye coordination and all that. Uh, it just takes a little bit of practice. I mean, I actually had to redraw this several times before I was. Uh, pleased with the this image right here before I got to this point so um, you know don't don't worry too much about it at first if you don't get it quite right and again you can see that the web is not perfectly round it's kind of el elongated it's, it's elliptical looking and uh, I think that just makes it look kinda cool Here we go. Okay, all done with the sharpie marker, at least for outlining. Now it's time to erase. Got my trusty kneaded eraser. Gosh, don't you know it? I've always had a fly show up in all these other, you know, lessons I'm doing, and now the fly isn't here. I guess it uh, got freaked out by the spider. Go figure. 
And for any of you who this is your first video and you haven't seen my other videos, you'll know what I, you know. Go watch my other videos. You'll know what I'm talking about. These flies were horrible this summer. I guess I should draw a spider every month or so to get rid of them, right? Yeah, I know. That that's really bad humor. Sorry. <laughs> Gotta say something. Okay. Once you're all done erasing all your pencil lines, you can see you've got this lovely, delicate spider web and dainty spider hanging from the edge of it. Um, and I'm just going to color this one in black. This is a nice, simple black and white drawing. Um, you can use it to accentuate um, a drawing of yours or something for Halloween, a poster. Um, you know, I'm sure you can figure something out. I really had fun creating this design because it's um, it's just nice. It's very simple, fun, easy. Anyway, I did have a lot of fun making it for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy drawing it as well. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to I Can Has Draw. Uh, if you like this video, please share it with your friends. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Um, also, stay tuned. There's some more Halloween videos coming your way in the next week. And remember, you can has draw.